You know, this is why it's important to have a strong negotiating team at the other end mm -hmm. of the table. I was highly critical, for example, of the Biden administration when they came in. Uh, they simply, essentially did a copy and paste exercise with putting the United States back into the New START Treaty. And the Trump administration, uh, we were heavily negotiating that through a very tough negotiator named Marshall Billingsley. Mm -hmm. And we were, we told the Russians, no, we're just not going right back into this treaty, even though you guys want us in it because it limits the United States. China wasn't part of it. And one of the deterrence failures of the Biden team is they came right in, did a copy and paste exercise, re-upped that treaty. Now, that sounds like a really arcane point that I'm making on your show. Mm -hmm. uh, but the point is, when all these little steps and all of these little things that you do, Putin takes everything as a signal. And if you go easy yeah. on him, like in the New START Treaty, if you go mm -hmm. easy on him on the Nord Stream 2 pipeline, if you go easy on him by stopping delivering lethal aid to the Ukrainians as the Biden administration did at the beginning of their term, he takes those signals, he reads into everything.